Imagine how fired Don Draper's Twitter uh, feed would be. Dude, Don, we don't need Don Draper. We have Gary Vaynerchuk. I, 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 I literally turned the planter's peanut into a baby and it made $100 million. What's stopping you from going down to a garage sale and bilking some retiree out of a cup that she's selling for $450 that you can flip on Facebook Marketplace for $12? You got a, you've got a phone in your pocket. Phone bad. Father, how do I click on yard sale? I will say though, when I was a kid, my grandparents took me to a lot of flea markets, a lot of yard sales, always had a good time. It seems like one of those hobbies that the internet has kind of ruined though. At least if you're, if you're, main reason to go to them was to try to get a deal. It seems like now, what can you do? Cause like, don't you just go and you're like, hey, there's a $20 baseball card they're selling for 10 bucks. And then when you go to buy it, they just look it up and they're like, actually that'll be $20. $20? Oh no, it's accurately priced. Yeah, but I like drove to the, to the flea market and it smelled, I'm getting like black mold spores in my lungs and stuff like that. I got, if I wanted to pay the accurate price for it, I would just buy it on the internet. What market are you going to? The Vancouver flea market. I did, cause I was reading, um, there's like what, thrift grift and thrift store hauls and stuff like that. Thrift grift is a subreddit for people who ha find insanely badly priced things at uh, Goodwill. It'd be like some insane shit, like a, an old cassette tape. It'll be like, this is $20. And you're like, oh, sorry. I, I use Thrifty Boy, okay? That's, I eat the ketchup packets that I just steal from tables at the restaurant, at the Starbucks where I get my stolen Wi-Fi using my brother's laptop.